Let's see, here we are at Gilman's Point, 7.01 a.m. We uh, started at 12.19 a.m. So it's taken us about seven hours to get here, taking me. I've actually lagged the pack by, I'd say, maybe an hour. Uh, the porters were really nice. They were carrying my pack. I am just really very, very winded and not able to catch my breath. Uh, at times they were even uh, holding my hand to get me up certain areas. But we're here and I'm still going to try to make it to a peak. Uh, and we'll see how it goes. 7.57. Disappointments. My chief guide here recommended that I don't continue on. I'm just so out of breath. I'm not able to catch my breath. Every 10 steps I'm having to really just gasp. So anyways, that's the trail up to uh, the peak and it'll follow the ridge line to over there and we can pull in you can see some people at the top and push away again well it was a great effort I'm not one to quit but he thought in my best interest that we still have a long way to go at least a couple more hours and it's gonna get uh, harder as it goes up uh, with even less oxygen Luckily though, I don't feel nauseous, or I haven't thrown up at all. And here's a view of the crater. <clears throat> and so he's now gonna walk me down to the camp. I'm gonna head on back. And that's the direction I'll be headed down to camp. Uh, in fact, you can see uh, the hut down there also, Kibo Hut. Right there. And we'll see how long it takes me. Right now it's about 8.30. <clears throat> There's Moenzi Peak. Saddle in between. And that's the view. Let's see, 2.45, we're on our way to the Horambo hut, and there's Mount Kilimanjaro in the distance. I actually made it to Stella's Point, which is a little higher than Gilman's Point, I've been told. And of course, to the left, is the actual peak, somewhere on the left. <clears throat> I ended up throwing up at around 16,600 as I was coming down. Just all of a sudden overtook me. It's been a while since I've thrown up, so I've always wondered what it was like since it's been so long. But uh, we're doing another three to four hour hike now after doing that mountain to uh, our next uh, campsite.